This morning we have come to join with the farm in this farming. As a bit of farewell, Tonka Gabu. Today, we are seeing the one of Prabhu we have known for so many years of our lives as we celebrate the 20, 81 years, sorry, 81 years of his life on this earth. And Prabhu, through your divine blessings, of Prabhu, through your divine grace, of Prabhu Gan, we have been in connection, we have been in contact, we have been able to share that relationship of Prabhu with him throughout the years of our life and his. Today we bring him farewell on a special journey, a journey all alone that he is going to go on. That Bhagavan, you're the one that creates a program us all. You're the one responsible for us all. But there is a time of program we all have to be redeemed of the thirty mantras. So as the real to perform this and teach this and scar, I ask upon your to please be able to perform this ritual. So I ask everyone to please stand up your private choice.
Put us all God's spot on us. Let us put us all eyes. Let us put all hands and pray. Let us pray for the Lord. Your creator. Your preserver. Your sovereign sustainer. May this come to our humble prayer here this day of the love of God. But may these prayers of the love of God, may these forms of invocations of the love of God, be imparted upon the Atma, the soul, upon the Gabo, and the spiritual realms. Let us pray. Adiyom, Om Sri Ganesha Enama, Sri Saraswati Mata Yama Sri Guru Jara Kamayo Namo Namaha Hayom Sri Krishna Yanamaha Hayom Om Mahapavitra Pavitra Sarva Sangato Tava Yasamrita Punitalaksha Sarva Hindantaro Siddhi Om Sasindra Paraswaha Swasti Pusha Vesha Deva Swasti Chariksha Vishnyami Swasti Mahaspati Dharatu Om Yam Brahma Varinda Rudra Maruta Sarva Chudine Sare Veda Sangha Parikshamushare Gayam Jiyam Shahamaka Dhyana Vasargate Namansa Pashant Jiyam Yogino Yashantam Abhirasu Sargaan Devai Tasmai Namaha Devai Tasmai Namo Namaha Om Namo Sumati Guru Kajaswa Hari Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya Hari Om Namo Prince Guru Sivindavan Yadavi Ki Chai 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 Aap Sabha Bhai Chai Ka Kiki 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 of our lives and the the connection, the relationship that we share. That Prabhu Bhagavan, the Sri Divine Grace of Prabhu that we all gather here to pay our final gratitude, our final respects to Uncle Gabu on this beautiful day of Prabhu Bhagavan. As we in this very auspicious period in time of this Naratri prayer, that Bhagavan you have seated fit to Prabhu. That where after performing all the seva, all the tapasya, all the sacrifices towards humanity, towards family, and towards you, Prabhu God, that Prabhu, it is time now we have to this journey out of this world. So, Prabhu, we pray for thee. Let us present our offerings on the Samanityam Sundaram Zalasatam Sanyeva Taravam Karana Pujata Pratikatanam Om Sasanindra Paraswa Swastinta Rikshari Shinyami Swastinta Rikshari Shinyami Swastinta Rikshari Shinyami 
Om Swastim Brahaspati Dadatu Om Swastim Brahaspati Dadatu Prem Sudhar Sima Shakti Devi Mata Ki Jai Vidhi Saranam Check one, two, sound. 
But in similar scene, Ariamadio Daki, they said that we are offering this gala of flowers, this mala. This mala, which just signifies our love, our dedication, our honor, our respect. Today, Prabhu Gopal, the Prabhu, all of this signifies the end of the cycle of this physical body on this earth. It is a Hariyom Nusi. Om Palmati Dharadharni Dhinyori Shishini Dhinyori. दिन छूती जाए संसार एक दिन छूती जाए संसार एक दिन छूती जाए
राम लगावे पार राम लगावे पार इन छूट जाए धनबार दिन छूट जाए धनबार एक दिन छूट जाए धनबार एक दिन छूट जाए धनबार हर एक दिन पवन परमेश्वर मेरे मन ही मन शर्मा मेरी चादर औरत कैसे मेरी चादर औरत कैसे और तुम्हारे
Friends, brothers, Vrindavan, Iran, E. As you heard those beautiful bhajans, renditions of bhajans, where is the Prabhu Bhagavan? And those who are our relationship are understanding in this world. That where is that you have created us in this world, Prabhu Bhagavan? Bhagavan, today we are seeing this, this individual, Prabhu. As we all call that Prabhu Bhagavan, where to pay our respects to him. We have been in love. But he has been a father, a brother, a friend. That relationship that we have shared with Prabhupada is going to be everlasting in our hearts and our minds. And that everlasting moment of Prabhupada is never going to deteriorate or never going to go. The memories of the individual is going to always remain. Being a stalwart in this community and society of Prabhupada, Prabhu, is very difficult and very hard of Prabhupada, at which we have to bid him farewell on this journey. But whatever is created in this world, Bhagavan says, there's one point in time that all has to go. Everything has an expiry date. Today we are, you are all here and we will hear all the stories. All the kisa of Uncle Gabo. What he was like and what he didn't like and all of these things. But no man is perfect in this world. We all make mistakes. Who don't? As Bhagavan says, if you, know, if you make a mistake, you suffer to ask for forgiveness. And when you ask for forgiveness, so that you won't repeat it again. This beautiful prayer mantra is going to be imparted upon the Atma to create that energy, that source for that Atma to be able to merge with that Param Atma. To you, Prabhu God, as you bid farewell to Him, may you, Prabhu God, receive all of these offerings of Prabhu that we are presenting to help in that spiritual world. Let's all clasp our hands, let's close our eyes. Let us bow our head and pray. As we pray, for his farewell in your loving arms of Prabhupada that you are taking him on this journey. Hari Om Sri Om Sri Krishna Namaha Om Sri Krishna Namaha Hari Om Sri Krishna Namaha Namo Namo Vigana Rupaya Paramananda Rupini Krishna Gopinataya Govindaya Namo Namaha Om Anadi Nidano Deva Shankar Chakra Gadadhara Akshare Pundari Kaksha Pritamoksha-rūpāvā Prachanda Kratatma Pritra Bhivanti Yakrama Atma Shanti 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 Atma Shanti 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 Atma Shanti O Mayodha Matura Maha Sivindava Milani Ki Jaisalam Prabhu, we have known Uncle Gavas for so many years. We have seen it in his good times, also in his bad times. You have been ailing for some while, but Prabhu, these are the challenges in life. These are the trials and tribulations that we have to all go, in, go through in life, Prabhu. And by these we go through in life, Prabhu Bhagavan, we can become one and even closer to you. Prabhu, the said the one who is without anything in this world, Prabhu, and we are able to turn to you. You always dare to lend a Prabhu God that support, that shelter, to protect us, Prabhu, in this realms, in this world. Prabhu, you are the Father Prabhu that bestows a Prabhu and compassion unto the unfortunate. As a Prabhu, we all are unfortunate in the soul, whereas that we attach ourselves to material bliss of Prabhu and the material world. Failing to understand these things are very short lived in the soul. Prabhu and Sri Krishna, this budget reveals the soul. Dukiyoko, Dukadu, Kari, J. 
काल की जय Respect of Panaji, one of the other Panaji in our society, Panaji Uda Ji. He was a family Panaji. I know it's an honor that we are that he is here today. He allowed me the opportunity to perform this antishti for this family. So Panaji, sit down again. कोई रोए कोई गाए कोई रोए कोई गाए कैसा तेरा संसार ओ मालिक कैसा तेरा संसार कोई समझ नहीं पाए Oh, Malik, how can 
जब चला जाता है सारा जब चला जाता है सारा उसका कौन दिखाना है एक दिन हमें भी जाना है एक दिन हमें भी जाना है जब चला जाता
point in time, I'm going to pass over the microphone to Panaji to run a word of prayer and a bit of greetings. such a way that you must have implicit faith in your dharam. Your dharam means your religion. And unfortunately today there is a, a bombardment of attacking our faith and say we worship all kinds of things. You know, worship tree, you worship monkey and all kinds of things. We don't do that. Ekam bis bahula vadanti. It means to say, God is known or is called by several names. You can call him Mango Tree or Mango Tree as it is. As you say, that is God in your faith. Your faith is you and your is your term. Today in the life of Baiji uh, <coughs> I've had the privilege, a very fortunate privilege, to be able to associate with him and do puja for him over the years. Unfortunately, today you will find that I'm not doing the ceremony. I have my dear Anil. Uh, he is holding the end for us now. The youths. I think you look more youthful now. <laughs> You're doing a very good job, and I, I have to extend my sincere thanks for doing this. I have had the privilege again of being with you on several occasions doing the same thing and I can com commend you for doing an excellent job. But there are certain things that we have to observe in life and that is one of the most important things that you observe in life is that there must be consistency in your worship, whatever you do. It must be and whatever you ask for, always in the name of the Lord. Without attain anything on this particular day, as Gurdjavan has been able to attain, your lot will be the same thing, maybe today, tomorrow, the next two minutes, three minutes, you don't know how long you're going to last here. I, I don't know how long I'm going to last. <laughs> I'm a cousin, I'm telling you. I have to go this way, this part here, and I must commend you all for singing those very meaningful bhajan here. I was listening to you very carefully, and I never, I didn't expect to see these, or this particular situation for Panel Anil that you are able to have, you know, this send off of my very worthy friend. He has been a man of sort of slaying qualities. I have known him to be constantly doing something. And this is something, you know, we we don't find very often. What I do find is everybody sit down by the TV when they come from work and dinner. He was the kind of guy, if you look around, you see, I'm amazed sometimes to see how many plants he had there. And I was fortunate to get some of these plants and some of the fruits of these plants occasionally. I would thank him today wherever he's going on this journey. As I see the mala and the flowers here, I hope that it will float and his path in the Baisani, that is the river that he has to pass through. It's a river you have to pass through there. We do go down and think to help ourselves at that point. But today I would sincerely pray that the, the flower here would make his journey a petal surface upon which he would trail to meet Lord Krishna. Additionally, it is, you know, very rare that you find that people will sit down quietly, diligently listening, or say sometimes the Baba never talk too much, you know. 
Oh, and now everybody have their work and thing to do. Um, with respect to the Dharam Patni, that is his wife. Dharam Patni will be in the life partner. And I would like to extend my sincere, deepest condolences. The children accept my sympathy. And I don't want to be too lengthy because this is a political situation. It's not a political situation. <laughs> and in politics, what do you want to make big, big speeches and things? I thank you very much, Panditji. And once again, thank you very much, Pandit Divaji. As I said, he's a family pundit for so many years, and he would have known Uncle Gabo for so many years. Another individual I'm going to call upon the microphone is someone who within the vicinity would have paid, showed respects to Uncle Gabo and would have always seen him. So I call upon Pastor David. It's not a nice thing, one nice time for, for death. For us as humans, we don't ever get accustomed when someone dies. Ten years will pass and it seems like yesterday. Twenty years will pass and we will remember it as though yesterday happened. To the Bui family, I ask God to comfort your broken hearts. I would say I pray this now, but I wanted to say I am, have known this gentleman for approximately almost 10 years. I have known all his children. Me and one of his son are very good friends, was, was very good friends, they're deceased now. For those of you who don't know his double son, O'Neill Opech. I have known his daughters. They are wonderful people. Praise be to Almighty God. And I want to encourage, when I pray for the family, I want you, and I would like for you to utter a prayer in your minds as I pray for them, because they would need the comfort, they would need your support as well. And I really see some wonderful people here, you know how to pray, right? You can say amen if you want, that's quite alright. We are praying people, and I'm going to pray for them right now, and for the family to be comforted because there is not sometimes not words that you can say to comfort the family. But I can tell you one thing though, God knows. He knows your heart. He knows within your heart and what you have there. He knows your grief. He knows what you are going through. I might tell you, I understand. But I don't understand 100% as God will. I might have an idea, an assumption could be wrong. But we do need each other. So as Pan said earlier on, he said we all have sinned. And we need to ask God for forgiveness at every time. We try not to repeat our sin. I have been listening very carefully. A wonderful service, I must say. So let us all go to God and pray. Almighty Father in heaven, we as your people, we as your children, O oh God, we come before thy presence, O oh Lord, knowing that you are Almighty God. Father, we pray, O oh Lord, and I ask you, O Lord, to put the bereaved family into your hands, O God. And I ask you, o Almighty God, to send your angels right now, O Lord, to minister unto them, O God. Give them, O Lord, the courage that they would need right now, O God. Give them the strength that they would need, Father. Bless their broken hearts, O God, as they bury their loved one, O God. We know it's not an easy time or an easy thing to do, to lose someone, Father, who has really loved his family. A man who was a stand-up, a husband, a good father, a man in the village, an elderly. Father, we know that you have more work for him where he is right now. He is in your hands, O oh God. And we pray, O oh Lord, that he also is comforted at this time, Father. And I pray, O oh Lord, to be with us and for us at this point in time, O oh God. And Father, we know that you are almighty and we know nothing is impossible for you, O oh God. It is we sometimes who minimize your strength, Father. But we know that we know and pray that you is the one true God. 
you are almighty. Father, we pray and we ask all these blessings and mercies and even forgiveness in Jesus' wonderful name. Amen and amen. Thank you very much, Pastor David. One other short person I'm going to call on the microphone before I pass on the microphone for the eulogy. A person who is known in the village and would have known Uncle Gav many years. Uncle Bagan or Teacher Bagan. I know I put him on a spot, but let's see. He would have been a teacher, he would have been a teacher, retired teacher, but as a well known person also. Thank you very much, Pandit. And it's Bajnath Singh. <laughs> That's his father, Father Pandit, Prophet Pandit. Members of the bereaved family, the Gulcharan family, friends, relatives, neighbors, well wishers. A very pleasant good morning to all of you. A sad occasion, but also it is a time some reflections. So allow me to extend deepest sympathy and condolences on behalf of the Bagan family and indeed on behalf of the Chandanago Perseverance community. Gab was a community person. This morning, friends, I just want to quickly say a few things. Each one of us and the pundits would have, I want to endorse, I want to endorse all the comments and contributions made by the previous speakers. We have all been given a life. Everyone has a life given to us by God. It's a great gift. It's a precious gift. What do we do with that life is very critical. In fact, Almighty God expects us to use that gift wisely, usefully, to the benefit of mankind and society at large. Now, I would have known from childhood we all grew up in the village right here. In fact, my recollections right now is just at the back there, during the dry season right now, we played cricket. There was a big cola, an area of land, where we made a cricket pitch. And we played competitive cricket, cockball cricket, barefooted. So these are things that comes back to me, I'm to mind at this point in time. What do I say about Gabo? It's a time when we do reflections. Gabo, very hard worker as a young man. We all work in the rice fields, the sugarcane fields. In fact, he was a master cutterman, if you don't know. Bicycle, he could maneuver that great facility. He was very versatile. Gabo was not only a farmer in the field, Gabo also worked with the Trinidad School of Motoring. So he was a good chauffeur, driver, uh, apparently sometimes instructing young drivers. Gabo was more than that. He was a great family person. I say this because I know of the family. The boys, Sunil and others, my sympathy and condolences to you all, sisters, the late brothers and so on. Gabo was a little more than that. Gabo was a good artisan. At the school I worked, at the Waterloo Presbyterian School, we purchased some pots, concrete pots, that Gabo made. I have a few at my home also. And my friends, I want to tell you, they are so sturdy. They are still there, over 25 years now. And those pots are there, large concrete pots in the plant as the pundit rightly said just now. She nurtured a great deal of plants around. So this morning, we rem what do we remember? Gabo's body has gone. His life will merge with the Almighty. But what remains is what Gabo would have done in his life. What we remember today. And that is what is going to live on in our memories. So brothers and sisters, at this time, I want to once again, on behalf of my family, on behalf of this Perseverance Chandanagar community, 
to express deepest sympathy and condolences to the bereaved Gulchoran family. And I pray that Almighty God, in His mercy and wisdom, will take care of Gabo as he goes to the great beyond. May he, have, may he live peacefully, eternally, with Almighty God. Thank you very much. Thank you, Uncle Bagan, Teacher Bagan, for the beautiful words of experiences and wisdom. So now we're going to have the eulogy. Good day, Sitaram, everyone. My name is Chris Andy, and I am one of many granddaughters, many grandchildren of Gabu, or as I like to call him, Nana. In honor of Gultra and Ramdad, also known as Gabu, I write this to commemorate his life as an honorable man, a husband, a father, a grandfather, a great grandfather, neighbor, and a friend. My Nana. My Nana began his journey of life on October the 10th, 1940. He grew up his entire life in Chandanago with his eight siblings. He went to primary school where and was compelled to leave his studies to help his parents. As a youngster, Nana worked in the cane field and the rice field with his father at Rupnarayan Sawmill. Eventually, he decided to get married to Dolson, my nanny. To provide for his family, he took it upon himself to become a truck driver at Siriram Brothers, where he spent majority of his time building his career until he retired. Nana never stopped there. He was a man known to keep on his feet. Later on in life, he decided to open a sow shed, where many of you in this village know him as sow's man or pudding man. He also sold his daily pigs of Bodhi, Sam, Karaili, whenever he got the chance. My Nana, my memory of Nana entails his garden. That was his most valuable asset. No one can ever doubt that. Every week, sometimes every day, we would get peas, bodhi, okra, and I will continue calling all because you name it, he planted it. Once in a while, or if we have a celebration, we get a little dark or hard fall. And that was very rarely, but Nana was very giving. Nana was a man who always was ready to set out a table for a family line. He would be the first to say, Let's take a sweet drink or ask if we would like anything. He was very persistent in that manner. Never, he always made sure that our bellies were left full. Nana was also firm, was also firm in his principles of religion and with his experiences in life, he taught the greatest lesson of hard work always pays off. He was supportive of us, his family, as we all seek our new ways. Nana was always a person who was proud to ask each grandchild and great-grand how they did in any test that we took. And if we did good, you know we waited patiently for our reward. As Nana followed one grand, we all knew to follow along for our collections. All these little homely acts made each and every one of us feel welcome and loved by Nana. As I end my speech today, I would like to thank everyone who came out to support us in this time of mourning. My family appreciates the concern and is grateful for everything that was done. My Nana definitely would have been ecstatic to see his entire family gather out once again. We will miss you dearly, Nana. Do rest as we know you are not in any pain. And I pray that you certainly are in peace. Continue to be with the family from above and look down at us as we will always remember you in our hearts and in our memories. We love you, we miss you, Nana. And this is not goodbye as yet, as we shall meet again. Thank you. Thank you very much. So at this point in time, we're going to conclude our ceremony. So I'm calling Shrutas, Yachman, asking everyone to please stand. Let us all cast our hands to close our eyes. We bow our head in prayer. As we bow our head in prayer, let us take a moment of silence, uttering our prayer from our hearts 
our minds to be rendered upon Uncle Gabo, his Atma, as going to merge with that Paramatma, that Supreme Being, as being consoled by that Supreme Being, by our prayer. Bhagavan, this is our humble, humble simplicity of devotions. Sivil Sivin of a Nihalani Jay Adyum Achutam Keshavam Ramana Rayanam Krishna Damodaram Vasudevam Harim Sridaram Madavam Gopika Vadavam Janaki Nayakam Ramachandram Achutam Keshavam Achutam Keshavam Krishna Damodharam Vasudevam Harim Achutam Keshavam Satyabam Adavam Madhavam Sridharam Radhikaraditam Indiram Adiram Chitta Sasundaram Divaki Nandanam Nandanam Sandhari Achutam Keshavam Achutam Keshavam Krishna Damodaram Vasudevam Haram Vishna Vejishna Vishankini Chakrani Rukmani Rangani Janaki Janai Vallave Vallava Yarachita Yatmani Kamsa Veda Vamsini Vamsini Dinama Achutam Keshavam Ramanarayanam Krishna Damodaram Vasudevam Harim Krishna Damodaram Vasudevam Harim Krishna Damodaram Vasudevam Harim Haryo Shantakaram Pujagashayaram Paramanam Suresham Vishwanaram Kaganasa Lakshmi Kantam Kamalanam Yogi Vijayanam Vani Vishnu Mahayanam Sarvamukha Kanatam Om Shanti 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 Om Namo Paramahitam Prem Svara Srivindava Mihanala Ki Chai Vara Sri Arima Devata Ki Chai Vara Sri Maha Vishnu Bhagavan Ki Chai Sri Ram Nam Sri Ram Nam Sri Ram Nam Those who wish to come pay the final respects Can we have a few for to do so? As beautiful renditions of bhajans were being played and being also being sung by Ananji and the group, Ravi. Thank you very much for our compliments. Thank you, Panaji.
Thank you, Uncle Balan. Thank you, Pastor David.
Tiene que ver con
Yeah, yeah, there we go.
Well, more come back. White players now.